Hello guys, hi. Thank you for tuning back into my channel. This is Prophetess Brown, amen. Born for Purpose Outreach Ministries, amen. Um, I wanna talk about something that's very, very important, especially for um, mothers and fathers and grandparents and even, you know, everyone. Um, because this video is going to be about our children today. Amen. Let me take out these glasses because they have a glare. But these are the glasses that I um, use when I'm looking at the computer a lot. And even, even my phone. And this hat protects against the blue light. Amen. So so that my eyes don't get damaged. Amen. But um, the other day, like last Monday last week, guys. Um, oh, I don't own the rights to this music. Amen. Um... Guys, I bought my granddaughter some play money like probably over a week ago. And the other day I was cleaning up the play money because she had it everywhere. And so the Holy Ghost said, pay attention to it. Look at it closely. And guys, I saved the one coin because I wanted to show you guys that um, this is, I hope you can see it. This is... Um, what's on one side of the coin amen it's a skull a parrot skull amen and um this is on the other side like a treasure chest i hope you can see it amen so um and it began to bother my spirit and i just want to come on and say guys be careful of what you buy for your kids um, and this is going to help me pay attention even the more to what I buy for my granddaughter. Amen. And I began to look up um, what, you know, the parrot skull represents. Amen. And the word of God tells us, do not be ignorant. Don't be foolish to the enemy's devices. He would try to get in wherever he can. Amen. If he tried to sneak in through toys, he tried to sneak in through items, he tries to sneak in through any door that he can get through. Amen. But we must be sensitive to the Holy Ghost and pay attention to what the Holy Ghost is telling us and showing us. Amen. About a particular object. Amen. So I begin to look it up. And the, the definition that I got from the parrot skull, mm -hmm, yes, the parrot skull, amen? It says, the design originated in the late Middle Ages as a symbol of death, and especially as a memento mori on tombstones. So, guys, we have to be careful and sometimes, you know, things just happen out of the blue. And sometimes we try to figure out, but well, what happened? What happened was um, a spirit creeped in and we was not aware. Amen. And and y'all, you guys, um, you know, sometimes you see this symbol on um, um, like chemicals, deadly chemicals that can harm you. Amen. And they'll um, put it up there, um, keep it away from kids or, you know, harmful is swallowed. Um, but they give you all kinds of um, signs that that chemical is dangerous. Amen. So I'm today. I know that this corn is dangerous. Amen. And I threw them all away except for this one because I wanted to make a video and show you guys. And the other side symbolizes some kind of treasure chest. Amen. So if this side symbolizes a skull, which um, symbolizes some kind of spirit of death attached to it, imagine what's attached to this treasure chest. Amen. So, you know, we bind and rebuke anything that the enemy is trying to sneak in through our children, through toys. Amen. And I, you know, I encourage all of you to go through your kids' toys. Go through their toy box. Go through their closet. Amen. Anything that looks out of place or does not sit well in your spirit, I don't care how much money you paid for it. 
get rid of that object. Amen. Sometimes um, things like this can bring nightmares to our children. Amen. And that's how the enemy tries to get inside of our children through dreams. That's like he tried to get inside of us through dreams. Amen. But our children are not able to protect themselves. So we have to be a protector for our children, our grandchildren, our nieces, our nephews, our godchildren. Amen. So guys, um, just I really wanted to bring that on because my heart got very, very heavy when I saw that, guys. Um, because I'm like, we have to pay more attention. We have to be more alert. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Amen. We're not going to be foolish to the enemy's devices. Mm -mm. So, you know, I, I encourage you, if you have any of this in your house for your kids, get rid of it. Amen. Because we do not want to invite curses into our homes. Amen. We do not want curses over our children. Amen. So, guys, um, you know, I, that's all I have to say about that. But please take heed. Amen. And um, somebody sent me a video the other day where a cartoon was um they was masturbating our children do not need to know about that our children should not be introduced to that type of spirit amen at a young age amen glory be to god be careful about the cartoons your children look at i was um, my grandbaby was looking at a cartoon the other day and they was cursing and i was like you gotta turn that you need to turn that you know so um you know we just we need to monitor our children monitor what they look at monitor what they play with monitor how they play with it amen monitor why their their um attention is drawn to this certain toy you know monitor your kids don't just give them a toy don't just give them a phone to get them out of your way we have to monitor everything our children do because the enemy is very cunning amen and he will try to do anything he can oh god he will do anything he can to get to us amen glory be to god and i just want to say a short prayer to cover our children Dear Father, in the name of Jesus, God, I pray now, Lord God, that you will begin to cover our children, God. I pray now, Father, God, that you will begin to touch the parents' minds and spirit, God, to be more alert in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, Father God, even get our children a discerning spirit, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, God, as to what to play with and what to throw away, God, in the mighty name of Christ Jesus, God. I'm praying the blood of Jesus, oh, for our children, God, all across this nation, God. Oh, Lord, touch our children today, Father. Keep them from molestation, God. Keep them, Lord God, from rape, oh God. Keep them, oh Father God, in such a way, God, in the name of Jesus, God, that the enemy cannot get to them, God. Put a shield around our children in this season. Ah, oh, yes, God. Eh. Oh, glory. Eh, God. Eh, the oh, God. Put a shield around our children. Children, God, protect them at all costs, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, God. And I give you the glory, the honor, and the praise, Father God. In the mighty name of Christ Jesus, God. Amen, amen, and amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. That is all I have, guys. But I just wanted to, because that was that touched my heart so and and I felt led to come on and do this video because sometimes we just don't pay attention to things unless the Holy Ghost pointed out to us so I give God all the glory all the honor amen for um this video for sh pointing um that symbol out to me amen I love you guys so much stay safe stay prayed up amen love one another forgive one another don't hold grudges. Mm. God said, what love and kindness have I drunk thee? Ask God for more love if you need it. Amen. I love you with God's best love. Amen. 
see you real soon please like this video please like give me a thumbs up because that helps the content of my video amen so um please um subscribe if you have not subscribed to born for purpose outreach ministries amen glory be to god i love you guys so much be blessed be back soon bye bye